The officer fires his weapon after several people are shot in West Baltimore Tuesday night. WMAR 2 News' Mark Roper is live at police headquarters in downtown Baltimore. Mark, just unbelievable that we have to deal with this, with everything happening right now. What are police saying about the victims in this shooting? Yeah, Ashley, good morning. They say that five people were shot. All of them are expected to be okay, but they also say two more people walked into a hospital around the same time of the shooting, and police believe that they also may have been shot during this incident. Now, this happened around 6.30 Tuesday night at the corner of Utah Place and McMeckin Street in Madison Park. Baltimore Police Commissioner Michael Harrison says an officer was walking out on patrol when the officer thought he saw someone firing an automatic weapon on a group of people. The commissioner says the officer responded and engaged with the suspect, then fired his weapon. And since an officer fired a weapon, there will be a standard internal investigation. There is a nearby housing complex, which was shut down for a few hours, and many residents were upset they couldn't get inside. But neighbors who heard the gunshots during the shooting said it sounded like a war zone. Shots finally stopped after like 30 shots, continual shots. And, you know, people were running this way, people were running that way. Um, one gentleman got hit. He was laid out in the parking lot over there. Now, police haven't arrested anyone for this shooting yet, and they haven't released any information yet on a suspect. We are live in downtown Baltimore Police Headquarters. Mark Roper, WMAR2 News.